Yes, Miss Bell. Captain Hook admits defeat. Tomorrow, I leave the island, never to return. I'm glad to hear that, Captain. I'll tell the crew and... And that's why I ask you of me, dear, to help me, sir. I bear him no ill will. Oh, Pan has his faults, to be sure. Uh, bringing that Wendy to the island, for instance. Dangerous business, that. Why, rumor has it that already she has come between you and Peter. But what's this? Tears? Then it is true. Oh, speak the way of a man with a maid. Taking the best years of her life and then... <gasps> casting her aside! Like an old bar! Eating a bloomin' <gasps> shame! But we mustn't judge Peter too harshly, my dear. It's that Wendy who's to blame. Mr. Smee, we must save the lad from himself. But how? It's <laughs> <laughs> the time we sail in the morning. Sail! That's it, Smee! We'll Shanghai, Wendy! Shanghai, Wendy, Captain? Take her sea with us, with her gun. Pan will soon forget this mad infatuation. Come, Smee, we must leave immediately. Surround Peter's home. But, Captain, we don't know where Peter is. Great Scott, you're right, Smee! What's that, my dear? You could show us the way? Why, I never thought of that! Take this down, Smee. I take this down, Smee. Oh. Aye, aye, Captain. Start at peg leg point. Start at peg leg point. Forty paces west of Blind Man's Bluff. Blind Man's Bluff? Yes, yes. Hop, skip it, and jump across Crocodile Creek. Nor by northeast. One, two, three. Well, get on with it. Continue, my dear. I mustn't harm Peter. Madam, Captain Hook gives his word not to lay a finger or a hook on Peter Pan. <laughs> Hangman's tree, so that's the entrance to his hiding place. Thank you, my dear. You've been most helpful. <laughs>